The first thing that my members were chatting about on our forum and elsewhere was, we're just gonna skip Georgia. Um, now, the Atlantic Intracoastal goes right through Georgia, so skipping it for the types of boats that my members are aboard isn't really practical, but it is very practical for them to fuel up and provision before they hit Georgia and wait to do so again until they leave the state. When they're saying skip Georgia, they mean not spend money here. Um, and flat out, you know, I can quote several of them saying, I'm gonna spend my money someplace where boaters are welcome. And the message that Georgia has sent with this is that well, we don't want you here and uh, take your money someplace else. And that's what they're planning to do. In fact, we had an event last week in Fort Myers where one of our presenters was covering um, the section of waterway that comes through Georgia. And he was pointing out where in Jacksonville <laughs> to, to fuel up um, before you hit Georgia and where the first fuel was when you crossed into South Carolina so that people could avoid spending their dollars here. That really is a shame because you know, the marinas here who would love to have people stay longer um, and you know do some of the sightseeing that loopers like to do and the marinas who could be selling fuel are not going to be able to do that because people are just going to speed through as fast as they can.